guys. Yo, ready, kids? Your boy makes his back. Bit more. V3. I just want to see a Bersario, please. Please. I need to know a Bersario, please. Please. I need Then there is. Good. I won't have to panic that much. Feels good, man. Alright. Last time we explored some places. We explored the fourth floor. And then, oh shoot. And explored the uh, um, Tenko's ultimate lab. And last time we saw me when the keyboard ring all shifty talking together all sneaky so let's just check out what's going on shall we let's check it out let's check it out careful not to make a sound i opened the door and peeked inside i heard a strange sound when i looked for the source of the sound my eyes were met with an unbelievable sight. Oh my. Man, you're really plugged up. You're practically throbbing. Man, those are some big knockers, if you know what I mean. Holy sugar tits. Mm. Good start with the stream, boys. Good start. I'm definitely, I'm definitely happy. So then for later. It's gonna be good thumbnail for you too. Hey! Throbbing with dust and debris, that is. Oh, but there were so many new endos to be had mm -mm. there. This is no good. No good at all. You must feel so pent up. I apologize. I've been neglecting my needs ever since I got here. Thanks, random car rolling by. We love you. Oh man, Kibo, you gotta take better care of yourself. Relax. I'll get it all out. Trust me, you'll feel much better afterwards. Trust me. Man, he was gonna have the time of his life. Oh, um, thank you? Hey, you better be thankful, boy. Oh yeah, your chassis is firm. Really firm. Like, damn. Oh, damn. Your body is seriously incredible. I've never seen one like this. Be careful. Be gentle. That tickles. This is amazing. Whoever put you together definitely knew what they were doing. Oh, I feel all tingly. I don't call her on my boy cable just yet. You definitely know what you're doing, too. If you keep this up, I just might. What? Oh! What? <laughs> <laughs> so that's the sound you make when I touch that spot. Good to know. Oh, my. I closed the door without a word. No place I wanted to see so much more. He was just doing some maintenance on keyboards, buddy. That's all it was. Indeed. Nothing but that. Oh, come on, Shuichi. Let me get in. No. No. Let me get back in. Let me get back in. Let me be a pervert for once in my life. I'm not giving up. I'm not giving up. It's the way of the fixer and I'm not giving up. I'm not, I'm not stopping. Let me back in. I want to see more. Fine. Have it your way. But I still don't know where this hammer would go. Where would I hammer time? I have no idea. Hello? Ah! Hello, little buddy. What's going on? Oh. I can see the inside of the stairs. 
happy. Kurumi's final moments. I can't get the image of her running for her life out of my head. I can still hear her. Her scream of defiance. I also read this the last time. So you know what else. But where the hell does this go? Was that a spot I missed last time? Probably. Hmm. Maybe the sink will tell me all the secrets that I'm looking for. No. Hmm. Where else have I not been? But I already did that though, didn't I? That's how the casino area opened up. Can I go back in? I can. That's not great. Something I missed. Okay, right? I already did this. Oh. What's that? It seems like such an open place. I wish I could go there. to go. Hmm, this this is annoying. I think that no. Okay. I don't suppose it's this thing. But I don't think it's a dormitory. I'll check the casino just in case. No, not here either. God damn it. So it has to be inside. There's no other way. Right, can I go upstairs? Yeah. What? That's just confusing as shit. Where else have I not looked? I don't know. There's such a mysterious mystery, I have no idea. Something though. Hmm. 
Can I go into labs? No. Okay. Hmm. Sana Ferreira. I wish I could ask the Monocops for help. But they're not gonna help. Because they're such shuddy pieces of engineering. I wish Monaco was still here. He was the OG, he was the best. He's. He's just amazing. But these guys. No. There's no way it was on the fourth floor, right? And it couldn't have been in the basement either. Hey, Manakuma. Uh. Hey! What are you doing here? Manakuma stared at me in silence, then disappeared down the hallway. Uh, um. I suppose he wants me to follow him. What could be down there? I'm willing to follow him. His Monokuma, after all. His goddamn Monokuma. OG. The best Monokuma. The best Kuma. The best Mono. Just the best. He's the mascot. There he is. Hey, buddy. You're right. Is this what you want me to do? Buddy, you want me to break this? Welcome is glancing back and forth at me and the picture on the wall. Uh, um... Hmm? This picture? Huh? Ah, I see. It's not a canvas. It's a pane of glass. Hmm. Perhaps... Maybe I should use the item I haven't used. All right. It's worth a try. I had the hammer in my hand, placed the glass in front of me, and threw it as hard as I could. Um, see, I knew Monokuma was the best of them. He helped me. He helped me I get to it. the last location. He's the best Monokuma. Not those shoddy Monokops. Sons of bitches. Just as I thought. There's a hidden passageway here. Thanks, Monokuma. Hold on, hold on. Yes, that's it. Thanks, buddy. Yeah, that's right. Thank you. Just thank you, Monokuma. I knew you were the best of us. I don't know what he's up to, but this did really help us out. The passageway looked different than the haunted house. More like a factory. Hmm. This is... eerie in a different way. I knew Monokuma was the best Monokuma. There's Monokuma after all. OG Monokuma. I knew I could trust him. Whoa. Hmm. Huh. All broken TVs. Wonder what's up with that. But that should hold some clues. Wait, maybe this is Kibo's lab. Or not. It's a giant machine. I've never seen this before. What could this be? Maybe this is the machine that makes the monocups? You bastards! If you've come this far, that means you solved the painting puzzle. Wonderful. Excellent teamwork. Yeah? What timber? It's just Shuichi. That puzzle was too difficult for one person to solve. I'm sure. They got along and solved it together. Let's just play along. We'll put ourselves in danger if we define you. 
It's true what they say. The serious ones are the scariest when they finally snap. I'm certain it's not possible. But did that outdated piece of junk help you at all? No. So? Oh yes, we should explain this room. How dare you! Outdated piece of junk! Marco Mr. Ba I hope it gets executed this round around. I'm not gonna be happy if it doesn't get executed. He needs to go. He's stopping this killing him. Shut it, piece of shit. Piece of scrap. Anyway, so, this is the computer room. Ah! But this computer isn't just some ordinary computer. This computer you're looking at is, like, super amazing. If I remember correctly, it's so amazing you can even use it to create a new world. A new world? Okay! Yeah, a new world. Use this to create a new world. Hmm? Wait, we're supposed to end it. I've already forgotten the plan. Aww. You're totally safe, Marty. Sorry! Ah, I knew it. Aww. You're so forgetful, Monotaro. You gotta try to remember what you can and can't see. Aww. Sorry. Why didn't you help him, Monophonics? Eh? Huh? When you realize he was saying too much, you could have helped him, right? So why didn't you? I cannot forgive that. Your friends, right? So why didn't you help him? Ah, uh, uh, I will not forgive that. If you can't get along, you will all be punished. You too, Monotaro. Friends share everything, even punishments. Yeah. What backfire! So long, farewell! He's completely homicidal. He's completely crazy. This machine can make a new world. Why are they talking about it? But... I'm not good with computers. I think I'd understand it no matter how much I investigate. But I don't trust this. If this is gonna be another... Fuck. If this is gonna be another fucking... What is it called? Neo World Program. I'm gonna be pissed. Oh. Slap. Slap. Time to get some money. Really, you can't stop on this. It's like the number one thing that you should be able to stop. Oh well, I suppose it's time to remember some more. There's a giant green computer in the middle of the room. This machine can make a new world. What could that mean? With how little I know about computers, I don't think I stand a chance. I guess I have no choice but to leave it be for now. I guess it's time to remember. Ah, a treasure chest! I opened the chest eagerly and... I found one. A flashback light. At this I can find out what this place is. Why we're here. Kokichi! <laughs> oh, you found the flashback light! Wow! You're pretty dependable, despite that lame face of yours. I respect that. Uh, okay. Yeah. All right! I'll get the others. You just bring that to the dining hall, Shuichi. Okay. Well, off I go. See ya! Each other way, and I couldn't get involved in edgewise. They left waving goodbye. Hmm. Weird. But it's all thanks to Monokuma and that shoddy green piece of shit will not know about it. How dare he defy Monokuma? No one can defy Monokuma. I refuse. I will not let anyone defy Monokuma. He's the best of us. Did I mention that too many times? But he's the best of us, he's the best Monokuma. He's the best all around. Because it's true. And no one topping Monokuma. I refuse. Anyway, let's get the dining call, figure out what's happening. And where am I? Right here, right. Oh, 
Okay. Oh. But it should prove interesting. I didn't think so. Getting more memories back. I hope it's gonna be about the ultimate run. Or at least about the crisis outside. And not some lame memory. Because I don't wanna know more. <gasps> what if it was about the meteors? Wow, is that everyone? That's... Really? No, we're missing two people. Shinji, is it true that you found another flashback light? Okay. Yes, it's true. I see! Wait, so Kokichi wasn't lying. I'm stunned. Startled. Shocked. Thank goodness. See, I told you I wasn't lying. Good thing too, because I don't want my pants on fire. Actually... I want to start talking about what we are going to do, but Kaik isn't here yet. Neither is Maki. Ah! Maki's not here either. Ah! Oh, Maki's not coming. I didn't invite her. Huh? Huh? You didn't invite her? Hey! Hey! Forget about the killer! Hey! Neil! Keyboy! Can you guys see the computer room on the fourth floor? Huh? Computer room, you say? Go on. Hey! Yeah, there was a big computer on the fourth floor. Would you take a look later? Your people might know something about it, right? My apologies. I'm sorry, I'm not very computer savvy. You're a robot, mate. How about you get useful? What? Oh, is that so? That's unexpected. <laughs> I've been meaning to ask, but Kivo, what is your talent exactly? Well... I could do all sorts of things. Indeed. Oh, yes. I'm pretty good at one-man comedy shows if I do say so. Don't worry. Kivo's existence is the only ultimate thing about him. Other than that, he's got no talent. Do not mock me! I just told you I'm good at one-man comedy shows. Hmm. I don't get it, but we just need to check out this computer room, right? <laughs> I'm not gonna come just for some computer. It's gonna take way more than that. Uh, um... Uh, well, the Murkops did say it was amazing. Yo! Hey, thanks for waiting. Did you bring me... Okay. Yes! Ah! Oh. Kaito! And... What? It's just Maki. Huh? Maki? Why is Maki with you? Why wouldn't she be? Of course! Oh, this is about the, that flashback light, so everyone should be here, yeah? <laughs> but when you say everyone, do you truly need to include the professional killer? <sighs> I'm leaving. No, Maki, please! Come on, man. Wait, hey, hold on a sec. I could Maki's hand before she could. By the way. Okay, so didn't you say you wanted to take down her mask or Got it. Yeah, I'm gonna take down her mask as a murder. Huh? What? Hey, so... I just can't believe a girl like her is capable of killing people in cold blood. Um... Is it true? Are you really the ultimate assassin, Maki? Have you killed anyone before? Okay. Yes. Really? But... Why are you hide? <laughs> Isn't it obvious? It's so she could kill us all before we figured out her identity. That's wrong. It's because I knew you guys would react this way. Huh? What? Because. When people learn my ultimate time, they get the same friend eyes that you all have. Eventually, that fear will turn into hate. And then someone will try to kill me because they're afraid I'll kill them first. That's... That's not... What's the point? Whenever someone learns my real identity, they try to kill me. It happens every time. Always. Huh? Always? Hmm. You've lived a pretty sad life, Maki. That's so mean. Oh, poor, poor Maki. I feel so sorry for you. I think I'm about to cry. Oh, I see. Because of everything you've been through, human life has no value to you now, is that it? Jeez. She was an assassin, not some murderous fiend. Ha, <laughs> Jackie boy. Or should I say Jackie girl? She was a girl. Even if she did kill someone, that doesn't mean she thinks it's okay to... <laughs> hey, can you let go of me now? Hmm? Oh. Oh. Try to finally let go of her arm and... Maki let out of sight. It's okay. I knew you wouldn't believe me. Ah, oh, come on, girl. Don't be like that. That's why I kept it a secret. And tried to avoid you guys as much as I could. Oh, annoying. But someone who doesn't know how to mind his business kept dragging me places. Huh? Huh? Are you talking about me? Well... However, I'll say this. I have no intention of killing any of you. Unless one of you tries to kill me first. <sighs> Having said that, you probably won't believe me anyway. Then... So? You guys mind your business, I'll mind mine, and we'll all agree to avoid each other. Please, just pretend I'm not even here. Oh, but I like you. 
Sure, you were not so nice in the past, but hey, what can you do? It started out as a threat, but the last bit seemed a little sad. Kaito, you've got to do something, my boy. You're so dumb. Jeez, Kaito, what were you thinking? Are you trying to turn us against each other? I think I speak for everyone when I say, we're all disappointed in you. Right, guys? No. I didn't say that, but... Tell me your thoughts. Shall we finally get started? We've all gathered here for the flashback line, yes? Everyone! Yeah, so... Have you all decided what we're going to do? Sneak attack! I'll watch it. Use it, of course. You might be able to remember something new. Mm -hmm. uh, a true purpose of the ultimate hunt. No. Well, I don't know for sure if it's got anything to do with why they're trapped here. Maybe about Marakumas. Maybe about the meteors. Maybe. What was that? I'm giving that Vishy Washi bullshit. Of course, it's got something to do with it. Hey! Right. Hey, instead of arguing. It's way faster to just use it, you know. You right? Yeah, don't worry, but we gotta do it. But, but... No matter what you remember, you can't think about wanting to leave this place. Come on, come on! If you think like that... Uh-oh! We'll just be repeating ourselves. You gotta be kidding me! I know that, and we can't go around repeating ourselves. We must do it. Then let's give it a try. Shichi, go for it. Uh... I'm a little nervous. I'm just... sort of... just plain nauseous. I don't like the fact that she keeps repeating plain and stuff like that and normal. She ain't normal. Everyone turned their eyes to me and I flicked on the flashback light. And at that moment, once again, the world warped. What's it gonna be this time? What's it gonna be? That's a nice tree shit, but... My consciousness went white, and somewhere in that whiteness, a scene played. What? They were so young and talented. How could this happen? What? No, I'm not okay with this. It looked like an accident. They were running away from that group. This ain't cool. Was it really just an accident, though? I honestly can't believe that. Who are these guys? They ain't dead. <laughs> They're all living beings, goddammit! What was that? A funeral? It was mine. Because everyone's here. Huh? Why? What was I at my own funeral? What? You too, Shuichi? I see. But the we all remember the same thing. The fuck's going on? What the fuck does it mean? Why was I watching your guys' funeral? And why was I there too? Wh why? What the hell is going on? What was the funeral? Hmm. But the only thing I can remember is seeing that funeral. Nothing else. No way! Maybe we already dead? <laughs> no way! <laughs> Jeez, this is so stupid. I couldn't help but laugh. I mean, there's no way that was our memory for a funeral. Then. Then what was it? Unless it's got something to do with the machine on the fourth floor. I mean... It was probably a memory for a school festival or something. What? School festival? That's right. It was probably a memory from play with it for the school festival or something. Yeah, that's why we're running away from a certain group, huh? Kaito? I mean, isn't it obvious if you just think about it? Of course! That funeral was real. There's no way we'd still be alive. <laughs> That's true. Um... But aren't we all from different high schools? Why don't we have a school festival together? Well, that's... What? Well, probably something... Rem we'll probably remember something else about it later. Got it! I can't speak. That's a car. Hello there. Anyway, there's no way that funeral was real. There's no mistaking that. Logical. You're right. If you think about it logically, that's clearly out of the question. Thank goodness! Okay, good. I'm going to think everyone was already dead. Don't worry about it. Stop saying stupid stuff. Look at me, I'm alive. Hail and healthy. <laughs> Hardy. Hardy? Does he get a hard on every time you see me? Oh yeah! I heard males can tell they're healthy by how hard they get in the morning. Is that true? What? Just stay in your line, bitch. Oh. I'm 
I'm not sure if they other people as dirty jokes. I'm disappointed. Oh, man. What a disappointment. Huh? A disappointment? <laughs> it's true. This flashback light was a real one time. Didn't find out anything about me, about the ultimate time. Just some weird memory. Okay. Yeah, serious. Talk about the disappointment. Nuh-uh. No, I'm not talking about the memory. I'm talking about you guys. Huh? What? It's a lie. Oh no, it's nothing. I'm just lying again, so don't worry about it. I wish you wouldn't have said anything in the first place. I wish you would be useful, rather. But more importantly, remember the funeral is so... Uh, can be a memory for real funeral. I have to learn more about this. No matter how I, now hard I think about it, I can't wrap my head around it. After that experience, we had a meal in the dining hall in the front door rooms. Hmm. Now I'm just thinking out loud, but is it possible to plant fake memories into someone's head? Is that possible? Oh, I'm just thinking stupid. I don't know. I feel like there's some kind of secret about that funeral. I can't stop thinking about it. But it's hard to deduce anything from such a short scene. I could ask Monokuma for a hint. That would help, but would he even answer in the state he's in currently? Hmm. I feel like he just blankly there it is. I shouldn't waste my time trying to solve an unsolvable problem. I still have some time left today. Maybe I had that in. Clear my head. Right. Well, first things first. I want some more money. Money. I haven't seen the last one. I drives around, how cute! Look at him go. Oh, so adorable. And is that a Mustang? I think it is. I might be wrong though. I'm bad at cars. Still missing three more than the one in the glass shell. Oh well. That's what I did. Hmm, right. Who do I want to talk with? I thought I switched up this scene. I want to dress up. In honor of my purple I'm boy. Kaito Momota, luminary of the star. Hell yeah. Look at him. Right. Ooh, kind of want to spend time with Kaito. is dead, waste of time, feels good man. I don't want to talk to Maki, but I'm so close to finishing up with, up with Mew. I also fear for her life, because, I don't know, she just doesn't seem like the kind of person that would live long enough. So, I'm gonna go and talk to her. Maki's in her room. He's spending time in Marcus' lab, that's weird. Ah, she's in the computer room. Of course! So obvious! I'm not gonna fast travel because I might be able to spot some plushies along the way. But just in case, I also wanna check inside the casino because I didn't have the chance. Maybe it'll have a plushie or something. Oh, I see something. See? I knew it was a good idea. Hello. Oh, look at you. Awesome. awesome. I'm not sure I like the implication. Of course you do, mate. You need to like it. There's no other way. 
I'm gonna check just in case. Whoa, what was that? I just like jumped. Alright, let's see. Any plushies? Anything? At all? No? I see. It's probably just slow man sad. That was bad man. I'm still trying to think how things are gonna cool down. Because one of them obviously wants us all to get along. Kind of how one of them was, actually. Except one of them is way more drastic. I wonder if they would have been friends. One of me and one of them. Or if Monokuma will actually try to do something about one of them. Because I want the killing to happen. Even if I love all my babies, they're all so precious to me. Well, I love you, really. Here I am, but I think we have another killing up here. I guess it's just because of my love for the glass trials. Actually. Basement for the plushies. I don't know to click on the stairs. I keep forgetting. Nothing here. Nothing. Nothing. Right. There's the library. Huh? It's back to normal. Did Monokomo clean everything up? I suppose he did. Let's go this way in a little bit. Maybe we can find the plushie that way. That kind of adventure rate does that. Save those good a lot. Something I do. Oh, push. Huh. I think to say about this boy. No. Absolutely nothing. Thanks, Chu Chu. Thanks. At least we got some good money out of it. How much do we have? Okay. I soon spent at the casino because I had all the Monomono machine stuff. So it would be just pointless to keep them. Unless I want to spend some stuff in the uh, gallery. But I don't know that we can Need that many slaps? Huh. Nothing. That's disappointing. We're doing the wrong thing. Ah, it doesn't say. Those were supposed to be video game posters. Posters for Ultra Despair Girls too. That's what the script said. Much more detail would be about if it actually really happens. I don't think it will, but just in a what if scenario, that would be the main character. And what would it be about? Uh, what for? I know where I'm going. I have like the memory of a freaking goldfish. Okay, on the right. To the right, to the right. To the left, to the left. I 
Alright, here we go. And it's only the third floor, I believe. Yeah. Go on, Shuichi. Hurry up. Get your det detective legs going. Was there someone there? I don't know. I don't care. I thought I saw someone on the left. Creepy music. Woo! Excuse me for it. Actually, wait. Thank you, bro. Can I walk through this? That's lame. But I guess you would mind your step. Okay. Let me spend some time with my girl. Uh, let me save this in case. Because I know I'm absolutely gonna fail the gift process. I knew. You know. If I did die, my funeral would be way more awesome than that shitty memory. The whole country. No, the whole world would mourn my passing. Hey! You wanna lose your virginity before you die? Too bad. It's gonna take more than what your package to satisfy me. Even though you gave Shuichi some fan service material. You're a weird one. But I like him nonetheless. But somehow I'm gonna bring a little closer to me. Alright, let's give her something. What am I gonna give her? Bondage boots. She would go to enjoy. I'm gonna try the cufflinks. I already have one of that, so. What? What's this? I mean, I guess I'll take it. This is what you're giving to my lovely self. I figured you were a piece of shit, but. I guess I fucked up. Well. You know what's about to happen, lads? Because I ain't wasting. free time events. No, shut up! Shut up! Wait, there was only one? That's like, what the hell? This is an announcement! What did you do with them, you monster? I guess you figured it out once I talked to Mio. Holy shit, I'm not letting that go. No. I will speak to my... I, I don't know what, I, what to call Mio, because... It's just that... You know. I suppose interesting. I can already get lines again, bitch. Yeah. yeah it wants to be a bit more clever. Music score. Yeah, like she would like that. Rickshaw of Doom. Bird food. Crystal robot oil. Mm. What would she like? What would she like? Helping Yachi. Home planet. Oh, that's for like Kaito. Hammer. Tentacle machine. She would like it, wouldn't she? That's for fortune telling. Man, if only Yasuhiro was here. Gun of man's passion. I feel like that's an event item. There's a lot of stuff that I'm still missing. Never really notice until you take an actual look at it. That'd be a lame thing to give, right? Bob 
Marvel Bomb Gun. I want to say the reaction to this. Not because I don't actually like it, but I just want to say the reaction. Hey, nice. Whoa, I've wanted this for a while. I never expected you to have it, Poichi. Fucking slugs! Why didn't you give it to me sooner? Jeez, you just wasted my precious time. I was worried about Mew and her augmented toy, so I went to talk to her. You alright, Mew? She seems down. She must be thinking hard about something. Uh, um... Um, Mew? What? Don't, don't talk down to me. Because... No, I'm worried about you. Uh, <laughs> You're worried about me? Her voice cracked. I... I don't know. I'm fine, I'm not that upset. Remember! But you were talking about being augmented before. Um, so what? Even if I am human, it's not your problem. Okay. I suppose you're right. To me, you're still Mew. W why? How can you say that? Hmm. Mew? Your face is hurt. Is something wrong? Uh -oh. Nothing's wrong. Boy, is it hot. Aren't you hot? I'm hot. Guess I gotta take off my clothes now. Isn't that right? Okay, I'll take off. Huh? What? Wait. Out of my way! I'm not gonna need it all hang out. Wait! Stop! What? Take it off. Take off your clothes. Huh? Why? Ah! Just where is this going? Come on, just sweep it out already. Jerk it to my perfect proportions. No. What are you talking about? And hey, hands off. No. I think this is the most confused I've ever been in my entire life. What is going on? Hmm. Mio, what's wrong? Oh good, a choice. Are you sick? That sounds stupid. You should get some rest? Probably. Are you worried about something? Um. Are you worried about something? Huh? Shichi, you blockhead! What does a genius like me need to worry about? What? Oh, would it be weird if I was worried though? No. It wouldn't be weird at all, Mew. Even geniuses worry about things. Um. Oh, but it's just a heartache. Huh? What? I mean, what I meant was, hmm, uh, oh, I see, so that's what was wrong. No. Yeah, I'm falling for you. Huh? What, me? Huh? I said it first, that you're so worried about me because you're in love with me. No. I never said that. What? You did? Okay. No, I didn't. Oh. This way somehow got even redder than sure enough, really. Did Mew just confess her love to me? Boys? Rain yet? I can't fucking tell because this was just so fucking weird. It was long gone. I returned to my room. Dumb fun bit. What should I say when I see her again? No fucking idea, Shuichi. Because I might just be as dense as you are. Feels bad. Alright, so what was this about? Could you explain, Maladam? This is an announcement! Man, do I feel bad for them? I wish Monokid was back. I would punch the shit out of Mono. Mono. My. Mo I wish Monokid was back. So you could punch the shit out of Monodam. Because at this point, it kind of deserves it. It is now 10 p.m. It's very bad by time for us. You bastards. You two should sleep together in one big bed. Ah. The three of us could all sleep in one big bed, right? As close as we are, not only could we sleep in one big bed, we could sleep in triple bunk beds. Wow. They're bleeding from the nose. And Monofan is rice hanging up. And Monotaro? He just stared on the inside. Look at him. Right now, you're on the threshold of an amazing adventure. Man, them needs to be dealt with. Yeah? But whoever's in the tub bunk might fall out of bed and die. I can not get that close. That timer sign! I'm actually starting to feel bad for them. Night time. I have training with Kite. Yes. Yes. 
They haven't done it for a while because of the murder, but we're going to do it tonight, right? Hey, that... Hello? Excuse me for one second. Sorry about that. Anyway, in that case, I need to go to the courtyard. Yeah. I should wait. Oh, I have to go there myself. I suppose that's fine. I wonder if... Come on. Really? You can't punch the light away? That's lame. Angie and no one else. What's up, Angie? Oh me, oh my! Huh? Shinji, where are you going? Well, uh, no one in particular. What about you, Angie? I... I was just talking to the others. Huh? Talking? Maybe. Since they can't hear Atua's voice, I was explaining his wisdom to them. Uh, um, I see. Atua! Atua was touched by everyone's feelings. So he said we must all preserve the peace here. <laughs> I'm so relieved. I'll work with everyone to make this academy a paradise. She'll work with everyone? I wonder what she means by that. Bye, Yonara! Shuichi, see you tomorrow. I have a bad feeling about this. Yeah, because Magic Show was Angie's idea as well. What is she planning this time? Death. Murder. Suffering. Despair. All those things hmm. at once. It looks like Kaito isn't here yet. Then suddenly, hey, my boy. Yo. Hey, sorry I was late. I had trouble bringing her. Huh? Her. Hmm. Maki. Yes. Maki. Hey, Maki. Huh? Maki. Why is Maki? Stop being so worried. It's just Maki, our favorite murderous girl. Like I'd know. That's what I'd like to know. Someone kept buzzing my intercom and I got so fed up I finally opened the door. And then this guy grabbed my arm and dragged me all the way here. Idiot! Well, don't worry about the small stuff. If a guard train, it's more fun with three people than two, right? What? Training? The three of us? Is that really the reason you could drag me here? This is stupid. I'm going back. Ha! <laughs> you call this stupid? Listen up. When a hero has to fight with a big enemy, they train, train, then train some more. That's what this training is. It's important for a hero like me. All right. So you guys can be like super dog, cat, or horse by my side to help me be a hero. Uh, um. Of all the examples you could have picked, I mean, come I'm on. I'm right already. You really think that crazy explanation would convince me to stay? This is stupid. It's still stupid. I'm going back. Hold up. Wait, hold on a sec. Well, I said I was the hero. That's just from my perspective. But you know, even super pets think of themselves as heroes. Let's do it. The same goes to both of you. Each of you are the heroes of your own stories. So act more like it. Hey. I don't know what you're up to, but I told you both to stay away from me. You know this will end badly if you don't. So why are you being so difficult? Hey, so... How long are you going to run away? I don't know, but look at that cool look of Kaito's. He's just, just so confident and amazing. Anyway. Huh? What? Kaito brought his face close to Maki's. Hmm. Your mask, your mask is coming down. I could tell just by looking at you today. So, you guys mind your business. I'll mind mine, and we'll all agree to avoid each other. Please, just pretend I'm not even here. I mean... You're not the terrifying person the others think you are. You're just a coward. Hey, so... Hey, what's your enemy? What? My enemy? Jeez. You don't have to tell me what it is, as long as you know it yourself. Listen up. So how long are you going to run away from your enemy? Huh? Run away? Seriously? Come yeah. on! Yeah, you've been running away. It's pretty pathetic. That's right. But if you want to stand against it, even a little, huh. I'll train with you, so you can be strong. What? Oh. That's... interesting. Look. 
Fuck, he's getting angry. Kaito is just provoking him. Is he going to be okay? He's antagonizing the ultimate assassin. Hey! So, what are you going to do? Kaito! It's okay, you don't have to. Okay, okay. Fine, I'll do it. Huh? What? You'll do it? Then? Don't get the wrong idea. They just bug me about it later if I refuse. Oh, yeah, sure, the classic Tundra response. Ha! <laughs> so you do get it. <sighs> The only way to deal with idiots like him is to give up and just keep nodding. What? You, you don't get it at all! Huh. Whatever. You just better get ready. I won't hold back just because you're a girl. Hey. Well, what are we doing first? Alright! First, a hundred push-ups. Somehow Maki ended up joining us and the three of us trained together. Yes! That's so cool. My boys! <laughs> I love it when my bo boys get along. Boys. Yes. Not bad. Shuichi, you're getting better. Hell yeah. Hey, Kaido. No slacking today, yeah? I'm counting your reps. <laughs> I'm on fire today. I could easily do 50 push ups. Go ahead, my dude. I thought we were doing 100. Hey, what about you, Maki? Hundred might be too hard for you, so I should have done. Ninety-one, ninety-two, ninety-three, <gasps> ninety-four. That's pretty cool. I love that. <laughs> uh, what? Awesome. That fast? <laughs> ah, she just keeps going. I should have just left it like that. That was amazing. Satisfied. I am satisfied. Maki stood and brushed the dirt from her hands, totally composed. I love it. N no. You're done already? What? You're not even out of breath. I guess you've trained before, huh? <sighs> Aren't you breathing a little too hard? It's not like we really pushed ourselves. Well, that's... Before coming here, I did some warm-ups. I did it 500 push-ups, so... Kaito, that was the best life could come up with. Hey. Anyway, I'm done and you can say I didn't train with you. I'm going back to my home. Got it. Okay, we're doing training tomorrow too. You better be there. Mac ignored Kaito and left without a word. Jeez. Why is she gonna be so difficult? Um. Hey, Kaito. Why do you do all this? You help her? Hmm? If someone's weak, you help them out. Timber is important for astronauts. Huh. If someone's weak and suffering, there's no way you can just leave them. Uh, um. Weak and suffering? Maki? That's right. Well, in that sense, you're... Ah. No, your case is a little different. Huh? What do you mean? Shut up! Nothing! Anyway, let's keep going. You're still in the middle of your push-ups, right? <laughs> so are you. Huh? Were you listening? I did it 500 push-ups before I got No. It. Nice try, Kaito. Kaito ended up saying he didn't remember how many push-ups he did. I'm ready to just startle when we were exhausted by the time we reached 100. <laughs> At least I did it. At least I did it in the end. <sighs> so tired. When I got back to my room, I huffed out a deep sigh and fell backwards onto my bed. Hmm. Kaito bringing Maki. It really is crazy. But maybe it's because he's crazy that Maki came in the first place. Kaito, you really are something else. My eyelids closed as I continued talking to myself, and eventually I drifted to sleep. Hey, oh, it's Monodam. Yay. It's Matrix. Curious? Curious what we monocops do when you're not around? I'll tell you. We listen to foreign music and laugh at the funny sounding words. When we hear words that sound perverted, they get really excited. We also wear pajamas all day and lounge in air conditioned room. And when we all go out together, they usually make me steal. See, we're all such good friends, we're always together. Except when they run away, but I get caught stealing. I hate you. With a burning passion. Oh? It shouldn't be asleep on the job. It's pathetic. Ah! Kaito? Mar Marakuma is back to his normal self. 
Good morning! Well, it's technically still night. Do you feel that rested anyway? Huh? Monokuma. Yeah. Nice face, Shuichi. You definitely look better. You definitely look your best in the morning. I can't speak words because I'm a moron. Too bad. You could look better, though. I'm pretty picky about people's morning faces. Hmm. What are you doing here? And also, how did you revert back to your normal self? Also, I missed you, buddy. Are you here to kick Modan's ass? Yeah. How rude! My time is very valuable, you know. Since you fell asleep, still clutching the love key. Oh. Oh. I went out of my way to come wake you. I really wish you were more appreciative. Uh, um... Okay. Remember this thing I wanted to see now? Yeah. Yeah. Yep, yep. I'll tell you how to use huh? it. How to use it? <laughs> that key opens the way to a very special place. A place you might have seen in the vicinity of the casino. Hey, then. Oh, right. That building. I suppose it would have this kind of key. Mm? <laughs> you look like you figured it out. Thrilling. Good. A healthy teenager's brain is supposed to be obsessed with sex and lust. Monokuma. Now then. That key you got there should help you clear out some of those carnal desires. Huh? Oh, are you starting to get worked up? Are you ready to let it all hang out? Now then, please read the instructions. It's time for the talk, the love key talk. This is a key that is used to unlock the love suite. When night falls, you and one other person will be invited to the love suite. There, you will be part of that person's fantasy. They will see you as their ideal and basically just swoon all over you. Think of it as a kind of dream that lets you escape the school dark reality. That's why this music is playing, yeah? The absolutely terrifying Moyokuma theme. Definitely hits. That's why it's so important to play the role that person wants you to. If you do something that breaks character, the other person will wake up in anguish. And what happens there stays there. Memories are wiped when you exit. No, that's so lame! It's like a one night stand within a dream. I'm the best that we both forget it. Well then, that's it. Stay safe. Enjoy. Hmm? Well, you seem skeptical. Why don't you try it out for yourself then? Go ahead. Take that lucky out for a spin. <laughs> Looking forward to it. Now then, let love take hold of you. It'll make you sweeter than a bear's honeypot. Can I pick or is it totally random? Watched Monokuma bounce away, stunned. The key felt heavy in my hand. Hmm. Well, I suppose it couldn't hurt, but I have like three of those keys. Oh boy. Oh boy! Uh, yeah, sure. I was gonna end the stream, but... Now I'm just... Oh my god. No! <laughs> no! Oh, 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 oh. No! <laughs> Oh no! It's Korakio! Oh no! I mean, I guess I could have gotten something worse, but. Oh no, at least give a girl for the first one, you piece of shit! No! Oh, oh, no! Oh no. This should be fun. Every time I come here, I play the role of their ideal. Like some shared fantasy. Kyo's fantasy. I'm a little scared of him, but I won't deny him. I'm curious. <laughs> Shuichi, so you've come to me because you finally understand, yes? Huh? Well, what exactly do I understand? I suppose I'll have to feel around. Oh? Feel around? Was all the interest you showed in, in me merely a lie? Well, whether it is true or false is irrelevant to me. That passion you showed me, I fell victim to its beauty. So, as you wish, I will accompany you for but a single night. Do you understand? But as I said before, there will never be a time when I love you. You're right with that, yes? Uh, um... Uh, um, wait a minute. So in Kyo's fantasy, I approach him and he responds to my advances. 
That's an interesting fantasy, but I don't know if I can do this. Whatever is the matter. If you're suddenly apprehensive, you can always run away. No. I'm not planning on running away. Oh. It is quite all right. I wouldn't blame you. Rather, it is I who would be at fault. After all, I'm only responding to your feelings out of simple curiosity. That's... What do you mean? <laughs> it may seem frightening at first, but I will tell you this. You will enjoy it. Wait! What? What are you planning, Kyo? Do not worry. It's only frightening at first. Kyo's voice suddenly all, sounded almost soldier as he pulled the bundle of red rope from underneath the bed. No, please stop. Huh? What is that for? Of course, I already had a good idea what it was for. I made my way to the exit. He must have been anticipating that. He grabbed my arm with his slender fingers. Ugh. Oh god. He's gonna run. Oh no. His grip was surprising the him and he guided my body onto the bed as I fell backwards. Say. Where are you going? You're in my control. You just surrender. Kyo! Wait, hold on a minute. I didn't know we could go this far. Oh. Ah, you said that I could run if I wanted, right? I see, yes. I didn't indeed say that, but I never said I wouldn't stop. Huh? What? Ah, yes. In any event, let's revisit the topic of your interest in me. As I said, all aspects of humanity, even the ugliest, are beautiful. You took an interest in me. Spend time with me. I did not do such thing. What sort of beauty will you show me as I toy with you? That is what I wish to know. Um, you know, what are you going to do with me? Perhaps if you explain to me, I... <laughs> You didn't understand all at once. I will teach you thoroughly. Yeah. Never mind, you don't have to explain. I have to accept it all, no matter what it is. This could be dangerous. How do I get out of this? Make up your mind, Oliver. You were the one who wanted me, yes? I suppose, but also, if we could speak up a bit a little louder. What? 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 I can fix that, though. Uh, I could feel my words dissolving, my mind going blank. Well, the way you quiver with confusion is beautiful too. Now, give yourself to me. Your fear, worry, anger, and love. Oh, Jesus. I will reveal all of your beauty. I will open the door to a world of pleasure you have yet to experience. I swallowed the breath, breath and relaxed. A cord of deep red rope swinged from his fist. Kyo glided forward and... Oh god, what's gonna happen? Well? Oh. Is you have got a new team lost. Thank you. Why am I, what? Giving it up at the love ho at the hotel Kuma Sutra, which you've been unlocked. Oh, thanks. Is I'm not even gonna see it. It was just such a disappointment. If I if I'm gonna be done by Kyo, at least I wanna see it. It is now eight AM I felt beyond disappointed. This is an official announcement. Please assemble in the gym. Let's get along. Refusal to get along is grounds for punishment. <laughs> oh, madam, you're really obsessed with the whole getting along thing. That's right. Friends is the only show he watches now. I will not forgive that. If you don't get along, I won't forgive you. Have I used exercise to peel your faces off like mandarin oranges? How gory! That's so gory. Please get along, every. <laughs> oh. Oh, it's... oh! Ah! She puked again! Oh, it's blue this time! How rare! They say anyone who sees Monofani is blue puke will have good luck! Like, ultimate good luck? So long! Farewell! That'd be amazing! What? Is it morning already? Last night with Kyo. Was it a shame I still feel kind of sore? Assembly to gym, huh? I have a bad feeling about this. Alright, what's this? 
what did I suffer through to get this thing? Plus, sweet team, those memories will never fade. Uh, indeed, those memories with Korakio, they will never fucking fade. I'll try oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. I suppose it's pretty pretty easy on the eyes, I suppose, yeah. Oh my god. My word. Oh my god. I feel violated. Uh, I'm, I'm fucking speechless. I don't, I, I'm actually fucking speechless. Uh, I suppose I'll leave it here because that was both amazing. It was just amazing, disturbing, and disappointing at the same time. Disappointing because I couldn't see it. Oh well. Guess that's it for now. But hey, what did you spend another day? Eh? So, yeah. Thanks for watching, everyone. No idea what I'm gonna do next um, part of this. But hey, you should see it when it happens. So awkward. Anyway, bye guys. Catch you all next time. Bye. Bye.